If Ivanka Trump were to say, B asterisk TCH stole my look, she would be technically correct, which is the best kind of correct. Though, it's unknown if the dog Twitter user at which puppy posted on March 16th is a female or a male. However, most think the pooch bears more than a passing resemblance to Ivanka Trump, 36. At which puppy didn't directly reference President Donald Trump's daughter in the picture. She is an influence on YouTube, she wrote. However, the narrow nose, the messy pulled back ponytail and the overall whiteness of the dog left many shouting, Ivanka, no, really. That's how Twitter users responded to the picture, with some replying, OMG Ivanka, that's Ivanka, right? Is that Ivanka? Ivanka looks amazing, and Ivanka. Others also drew comparisons to Gwyneth Paltrow, she has a lifestyle brand called Poop, tweeted Zachary Elwood, and another paired the pooch up with a horse sporting a killer weave. Lady Gag Feet Beyonce Telephone Considering how much Trump has expressed his fondness for Ivanka, does that mean he's going to go out and try to adopt this dog? Nope. Donald has broken with a presidential tradition dating all the way back to Thomas Jefferson, he has no plans to keep a pet in the White House. It makes sense, as CNN reports that his first wife, Ivana Trump, 69, recounted in her memoir, Raising Trump, how much Donald was not a dog fan. Her poodle, Jeppy, had an equal dislike of Donald. Picked at twitter.com slash cput6rh2dl, at mpnrd, March 16, 2018 of course, with a vice president bringing half the farm with him from Indiana, there's no need for any more critters at 1600 Pennsylvania Avenue. Mike Pence, 58, and his family have two cats, Pickle and Hazel, a dog and a rabbit, Marlon Bundo. Marlon has become quite a literary superstar, as the bunny is the star of not one but two books. Mike's daughter, Charlotte Pence, 24, wrote a children's book, Marlon Bundo's A Day in the Life of the Vice President, which was illustrated by Mike's wife, Karen Pence, 61. However, one day before that book was released, John Oliver released A Day in the Life of Marlon Bundo, in which the Vice President's bunny is gay. John Oliver's Bundo book has the rabbit to feed a stink bug, one who not so coincidentally looks like Mike Pence, for Vanity Fair, in order to get married to his bunny boyfriend. John's book was written specifically to spite Mike, who has historically opposed same-sex marriage and similar LBGT civil right efforts. All proceeds from John's book go towards LGBT charities The Trevor Project and AIDS United.